It is October 10th. Hopefully something's gonna come through today. I've got a cornfield behind me and an oak hillside in front of me, so I'm hoping they'll be coming to these water sources in the river. 200 yards below me in a real thick bedding area that touches, that butts up to the corn, so the corner right behind me is all mowed down by deer, so I'm hoping something's going to come out in this corner. Uh, you can see it there. A lot of mowed down corn. And you look in front of me here, all oaks out in this little flat area. So, hopefully, something's going to come through this morning, or this evening actually.
Alright, I think she just went down in the corner up there. Looked like a pretty good hit in the quartering two shot. I tried to put it right through the center of the shoulder. If you want to watch the video back, see what it looks like. Be right back. Alright, I know you can't really see me, but uh, I just stuck a doe. Looked like a pretty good shot. Felt pretty good about it. Um, sounded like she didn't go far. She ran into the cornfield and I thought I heard her fall. Let me give it a couple minutes here. It's legal shooting light sending right now. I shot her about a couple minutes ago. So I'm going to slowly start packing up here and go check the arrow. But it felt like a pretty good shot. It was a quartering two and it looked like it went in at a pretty steep angle as far as my shot but it looked like I went in about center of the shoulder it came out right behind so let me get ready to get down here and go check her out all right on the ground everything's packed up go up to the arrow here all right lay my bow down Broadhead's still intact, that's good. Alright, looks like a good bit of gut on the arrow, but the way it came out, I figured there would be. Um, she was hard quarter and two, and I put it center of her shoulder. Should have come out probably in the gut, but behind her other, behind the rib cage there on the other side. Um, gut hits usually don't have a whole lot of a blood trail initially here so what I'm gonna do she kind of hooked around through the corn there I'm gonna hook straight through this to where I last saw her roughly and some short stuff right along the edge of the tall stuff let's see if we can't pick up the blood trail up here um, I don't think she went far like I said I'm pretty sure I heard her go down really about 35, 40 yards or so. Um, let's see here. All right. I last saw her somewhere right in here. She was heading up into that stuff, into the tall corn there. So let's kind of work this row, see if I can find any blood. Um, see if I can figure out where she went into the tall corn at. That'll be the kicker. I know she was, she would have been right about this path here. Oh, there she is. <laughs> well, that wasn't too hard. Didn't have to track her. There she is. Looks like a good sized doe. Let's let me get my stand off here. There we go. Looks like a good mature doe here. Yeah, good mature doe. There's my exit. I said I figured it was kind of far back. I'll drag her up here a little bit. Yeah, she's a good one. Good sized doe. Let's see my entrance here. Roll her over. Let's see. Where did the arrow go in at? There it is. A little higher than I wanted it, but I guess from the angle she was standing at me, it came out way low on the other side so not too bad good double lung and she only went I don't know what was that maybe 40 yards so awesome I hope you can see this but uh, got a good doe tonight good mature doe uh, good shot on her she was quarter and two pretty hard I put it, it was a little farther back than I would have liked to see it but she only went 40 yards so you really can't complain about that um, the newer property here, I got it last year during the gun season, took one doe off of it with the rifle. It was the first time I've actually bow hunted the property. It was a pretty good night overall. I had, first deer I saw was a real nice young eight point. Um, a little over ear wide, maybe right at ear wide. Real good po potential, good to an half year old buck. Right after him, I saw a doe way down the bottom behind me over here from where we're sitting now. Um, she was about 200 yards from me, milling around in some thick stuff down there. And then uh, the last thing, 
I saw before this one was a little little five point came in. He milled around underneath me for a little while until he decided he was going to go down the hill same direction that the, the bigger eight point did. And then uh, right at dark, I saw her moving in the corn. And she came out into the clearing in the corn right behind me. It was about a 12 yard shot. I had about three minutes of legal shooting light left, so it was getting pretty dark. But, you know, I felt confident, made a good shot, and she piled up within 40 yards of me. So I'm happy with that. And uh, first deer of the season. So I haven't hunted a whole lot, but I'm glad I finally got one. So I'm going to get her dressed out. I'm going to get her out of here. And uh, hopefully the season continues to be good just like last season was to me. So, that's it. <laughs>